Hi, I'm Mitch Gallagher. Welcome to Sweetwater's Soundcheck. This time out, a versatile subwoofer from QSC. Let's get started. Today we're checking out the KS118 from QSC. This is a powered subwoofer featuring an 18-inch driver with a 4-inch voice coil. It puts out up to 136 dB SPL. Now that's a ton of low frequency energy that comes out of this compact cabinet. We've got 3600 watts of power that drive a frequency range from 35 Hz to 111 Hz. As with all subwoofers, the low frequencies come out in an omnidirectional pattern when you're using a single cabinet. So they fill the room, and with the amount of power and the amount of energy this cabinet can put out, it can fill a good sized room. But the versatility of the KS118 really comes into play when you have multiple units. You can configure these in several different ways. You can stack them on top of each other, they do interlock together, they can be placed horizontally, vertically, side by side, one behind the other. And you can array those either as an omnidirectional system or by using the settings on the back panel, you can configure them for a cardioid pattern. Now this is a heart-shaped pattern that directs the low frequency energy forward out into the audience. It reduces the problems you can have with the buildup of low frequency on stage, leakage into microphones and so on. It really gets the energy out into the audience where you want it. This makes the KS118 ideal for bands, for mobile DJs, for venue installs, for clubs, for rental systems. It really is a versatile unit that will add a lot to any system. It mates well with a wide range of mid-range and high frequency drivers, and we have two different crossover frequencies for accommodating that. The back panel of the KS118 is very simple to navigate. Of course, we have the power cable and power switch, as well as an inlet for the low noise cooling fan. For connections, we have two XLR TRS combi jacks for inputs, and two XLR pass-throughs for connecting additional speakers, as well as a gain control for setting sensitivity for the input. We access the DSP power for the KS118 using the control panel at the top of the back panel. Although the DSP power inside the KS118 subwoofer is very powerful, we have just a few parameters we need to adjust to get it into action. We can set up the crossover frequency, and that's adjustable from 80 Hz to 100 Hz. We also have a delay setting. If we're arraying multiple KS118s into a system, we can set the delay properly so that they operate in phase. We also have a deep setting. Now this extends the low frequency response. It's great for EDM and for club situations. Finally, we have cardioid mode. You turn that on and off with this last setting here on the menu. When you have multiple KS118s, changing them to cardioid, again, makes them directional as far as the low frequency response is concerned. At the bottom of the screen, we can access the settings menu. We scroll down to that, hit return, and we're presented with basic settings for the overall unit. Now we can store scenes inside the KS118. This allows us to instantly recall all the settings, so if we're going into the same venue over and over again, we save a scene and just recall it quickly and we're ready to work. We can also set the power LED, whether that's visible on the front, on the back, or both at the same time. We can set up the contrast for the LCD display on the back, do a factory reset, and so on. Very simple to operate and easy to access all on the back panel of the KS118. I hope you've enjoyed this look at the KS118 subwoofer from QSC. It's a super powerful low frequency driver that works well in a wide range of different applications. With both omnidirectional and cardioid patterns available, it expands the versatility even further. Thanks for joining me for Sweetwater Soundcheck. I'm Mitch Gallagher.